Hello everyone. Sorry for the delay in getting my coastal living review out to you. I did promise I'd do it last weekend and I just didn't have the time. Um, I have reviewed all four of those so they will be in this one video. Um, sorry if I keep looking down as well. I did note down for each scent what I thought and the notes of each scent so I didn't tell you the wrong ones for the wrong scent. Um, so to start off with, I did buy Driftwood in a large jar and all other three scents in scented tarts. My reason for this being on a cold sniff, I thought Driftwood was going to be my favourite. It smelled the strongest. So I always like to buy one large jar out of a new set just to see what it's like. Um, I like to give one a go. But as you can see, here is Driftwood in the 22 ounce large jar. Retailing at 23 99 at the moment. 150 hour burn time for the single wick. Notes of cedar with water lily, eucalyptus and tonka bean. Um, for me, I'd still say throw 7 out of 10, but I wasn't keen on it. Um, very, very woody scent coming off of it. Very woody throw. Not really florally. Um, just very strong throw, but just not a scent that I like. Um, I definitely recommend it if you do like the woody undertones of the candles. It's definitely got a good throw on it. It smelled really strong in the whole room, but just not a scent that was for me. Um, I couldn't really smell anything specific other than the woody tones, so for me it wasn't a winner. I shouldn't have bought this in the large jar, but on a cold sniff it did smell the best to me. Um, as for the other three, I did get these in the scented tarts. Um, when I first review a scented tart that I've not had before, I do use the whole tart as well. Um, if I've had the tart before, I normally break it in half to make it last a little bit longer, but when it's the first time, I like to give it a full chance by using the whole tart. Um, to start off with, we've got Coastal Living, which is notes of sea salt, lavender, marine flower, moss and coral musk. This is my absolute favourite out of the whole range. Um, throw 8 out of 10. I loved it. <laughs> I didn't get any lavender come through, which was good for me anyway, because I don't like lavender smells. This was just very fresh smelling. It made the whole room just smell fresh and clean. Um, when you say sea salt to me, I don't think of that as a pleasant smell, but this was just definitely a winner for me. I will be buying this again in a large jar. Um, very, just, it's not overpowering at all. It's just lovely and fresh if you want that nice. I think it's definitely good coming up to spring, summer. Definitely a nice scent to have. This is my favourite out of all of them, and I would definitely recommend this one. Um, secondly, I tried Sea Air. Notes of seawater, salty ocean air, rose, beach flower and sandalwood. This one, not a winner for me. Throw 6 out of 10. It was nowhere near as strong as Coastal Living. It, it had a very slight undertone of the same smell as Coastal Living, but it's just it was so much weaker, so I just didn't really see the point for it. Um, it's, I was still getting like a salty, flowery smell coming through, but... It just smelt like a, a much, much weaker Coastal Living. So again, I'd definitely say Coastal Living over this one. Um, I'd still, obviously, I think Driftwood is worth a go, but Sea Air, definitely, I won't be buying that again. Um, and finally, we have Garden by the Sea. Notes of Violet Leaf, Peony Petals, Sensual Musk and White Amber. Slightly stronger than Sea Air, maybe a 7 out of 10 for the throw. Again, not really a winner for me. It was a floral, musky sort of smell, but it didn't really come through much for me, and it didn't it didn't smell as flowery as some other scents from Yankee Do. Um, it's it's worth a go more than the Sea Air one. I would definitely recommend, but out of the whole range, I would say don't try Sea Air. Just that's my opinion. It's not really worth it. It's just a weak coastal living. Driftwood. If you like the woody undertones, definitely give it a go. But Coastal Living overall for me has been the winner. Um, such a fresh smell. It was absolutely lovely. You can buy the tarts on the UK website now for $1.49. And again, the large jars are $23.99. I will put a link down below. And um, also the accessories for the Coastal Living range are really nice as well on the Yankee site. Um, but that's all for me from today. Thank you. Um, and I'll get another video up for you soon. Thank you for watching.